So this is not a scam, okay? This is for real. How to change your life immediately, okay? Now, I want you to realize that most of the time, most of your life is based around thoughts that come from the past and things that you've dealt with in the past, okay? And so the first step to take to change your life overnight is to stop thinking those thoughts that you have from the past, okay? This is very, very, very real, okay? This is very, very real. And until you can believe that this is real, it will not be real in your reality. You have to believe that this is 100% true, that this is going to happen. And that's the first thing that I want to talk about in changing your life overnight is to have 100% faith in yourself. We cannot move forward into these next steps until you know 100% that you have faith in yourself to be who you want to be, okay? Now, most of the time, we're not where we want to be because our thoughts are controlling us. Your thoughts should not be controlling you. And if they are controlling you, then you're a sucker because they're just your thoughts and you control them. So if you're not where you want to be, for example, in life and you want to change your life overnight, because obviously if you want to change your life, then you're not happy with where you are. Realize and remember that you put yourself there, that you are the cause of your current life right now because you can do anything you want. And I think we struggle. We really struggle with this concept of believing that we can do whatever we want. I know people who live in tree houses. I know people with kids who have got up and moved to Mexico. Mexico. I know people who've gotten up and moved across the country with their kids as single moms. Now, this is hard. This is hard when you think about it. It's something that you have to have true mental strength for. You have to truly believe in yourself to do this, to attain this. So, what do we have to do? We have to have faith in whatever it is that we're doing. <laughs> you have to believe and know that things can change and that you can do anything you want. And I'm speaking to the people who don't have kids right now. Me personally, I do have a daughter. I have to go pick her up in like 20 minutes, to be honest. But I do have a child. So I definitely want to speak on the people who do not have kids. Um, what are you doing? What are you really doing? If you don't have any kids, if you don't have any outside responsibilities, what are you doing? Life is precious and there's so much to do in this life. And all it takes is changing your mental state, changing the way you are thinking about things. Okay. I said, if I didn't have any kids, I would be living in my car on the other side of the country because why not? Why the fuck not? Okay. Um, and even with me having a kid, I want to move down south. And so that that thought alone is scary for me, but it's what I want and it's what I want to do with my life. And we're going to get into all that in a few steps from now. But the first thing that you need to grasp is the fact that you need to believe in yourself and have faith that whatever it is that you are trying to do will work out because you can do whatever you want with your life. Your mind has limited you up until this point. And today I'm going to get you out of that because you're so limited by your reality and especially if you're like still in your hometown and like you're, you're seeing the same roads, you're seeing the same pathways and the same routes. It's all the same program that you need to get out of right now. Okay. And that brings me to, sorry, <laughs> that brings me to the next step. And the next step that I'm going to tell you to change your life overnight is to be who you want to be right now. Be who you want to be right now. And don't think about this too fucking long okay you don't have to think about this all day you don't have to think about who you want to be all day long who do i want to be no think about the first thing that pops in your head and do that because the more you sit and dwell about all the things that you want to do whether that's being a musician or a youtuber or a content creator or you want to be an artist or you want to do this that and the third you want to be um you know a boutique owner you want to you know whatever it is that you want to do like there's a lot of things that we all want to do but Choose something. Just choose what you want to be the most. And when I tell you it's the first thing that pops in your head, it's the first thing that pops in your head. Don't get discarded by other bullshit that pops up in your brain. It's not true. It's not real. Okay. It could be real. But in order to change your life, you need to focus on becoming that one thing that you want to be, whether that's a boss or, like I said, a content creator, a musician, whatever it is. So in order to be who you want to be right now, you have to do the things that that person will be doing. So if you're sitting here on YouTube watching me right now and you want to be a content creator, 
let's be real. You're not watching me to find tips on how to be a content creator. Okay. That's what you need to be watching. If you want to be a musician, okay, you should not be watching me. Okay. Unless you go to my music channel and then in that case, sure. But you should not be watching me. You should be making music, you know, and it's literally that simple. If you want to be an artist, you should be making your art and getting your social media together so you can share that art. It's all subjective, but at the end of the day, it's so simple. It's so simple to just be who you want to be right now in this exact moment. Okay, and you don't have to be limited to one thing. You just have to focus on one thing. So I want to be a boss. I'm already currently a boss. Okay, but at the same time, I'm also a fitness guru. I love working out and I love lifting. I love lifting weights. So does that stop me from becoming a boss? No, it's just a part of my my routine. You know, it's just a part of my daily life. Okay, if I want to be a musician and a content creator, then why can't I be both? Why can't I be a musician while also creating content on the side? You know what I mean? But at the end of the day, you have to stick to that one thing. And then the other things that you want to do with your life are just a part of that one thing. So don't get so don't get so misconstrued in the fact that you have to be this one thing forever. No, you just go after that one thing right now and be that person right now. Even if that means you have multiple hobbies. (laughs) Okay. Um, It's very simple. It's very simple. Uh, just to keep your mindset intact and on track and, and on track. Um, like I said, our minds are all over the place. They're our biggest weapon is our what we're thinking, our thoughts, the way we react to things, our emotions, the way we feel. It all goes back to your mind and your mindset. And I'm not going to sit here and tell you to work on mindset all day, every day, because that's also a distraction. You have to be who you want to be in this moment right now, right now now make your start your business right now make that website right now make videos right now as soon as you cut off this video okay because you need to listen to the rest of my tips so that you can change overnight and not just for the moment and then going about your business no okay you need to ignore negative thoughts okay you have to ignore your negative thoughts you're gonna always have negative thoughts you're gonna always have negative thoughts the the key is to ignore them Okay, so there might be something telling you in your head right now that I can't be this person right now. Like, I can't change my life overnight. That's impossible. It's not. Ignore them. Ignore them. When they pop up, ignore them. When some when something in your head is telling you it's not going to work, ignore it. When something's in your head telling you that you can't change your life overnight, ignore it and keep moving. And that is truly how you change your life overnight, by ignoring your negative thoughts and believing that whatever you want to be, you can be right now in this moment. <laughs> and it's nothing stopping you besides yourself. The next thing I'm going to say is to change your environment, okay? Right now, I am currently on that step. <laughs> um... And I have a few tips and tricks for this. I, too, want to change my environment. I do not want to be in my hometown anymore. And um, I want to be by the water. I want to be by the waves, by the beach. And that's just what I want to do. And in order for me to do that, I can't sit here and be comfortable with where I'm living. I have to change my environment. And whatever that means to you is whatever it means to you. But maybe you need to work somewhere differently. Maybe you need to live somewhere differently. Okay. Maybe you need to um, take that leap, pack all your shit up, put them in boxes and be prepared to leave. Even if your credit score is not on point, you can't afford an apartment or a house right now. Even if all that's happening, you have to still pack your shit and get ready to go. Do it today. Do it today. And it's hard, but that goes back to tip number, the last tip ignoring your negative thoughts because you're going to get so many negative thoughts about (laughs) packing your shit up if you're not happy with where you're living okay oh but what about my job or what about my friends what about my family pack it up it's time to go it's time to leave where you are as soon as you honestly all these other tips cool they're great for long term and thinking long term about changing who you are But this one is the most impactful, changing your environment, because changing your environment is automatically switching what you're used to. Now, let's say you can't pack all your shit right now. What if you're what if you're very practical and you can't pack all your shit right now? No problem. okay? no problem. Leave the house, leave the house and surround your day with other things besides what you're used to. So let's just say you're in a city and you've been in that city for a long time, (laughs) like your girl. 
let's say you've been in the city for a long time get in the car and go somewhere else go to the city go to another city go anywhere you feel like going in that day in that moment even if you do have kids plan plan time today or tomorrow to get or for the rest of your days to get out of that routine of you waking up going to work get on the social media change up that routine because even though I do believe in an environment change, that is 100% facts. That is actually that is actually 100% how you change your life overnight is by changing your environment. If you're not capable of doing that, it's so easy just to change your routine. And changing your routine is the make or break of changing your life, okay? Instead of waking up and scrolling like you always do, it's bullshit, by the way. Don't do that. Wake up. And I'm going to get to that in the next tip bullshit complete bullshit when you wake up and scroll on your phone it's completely tearing you down it's completely fucking you up instead of doing that do something else um instead of watching netflix instead of watching love is blind read a book okay do something different go to the bookstore go to a library go to a coffee shop go to an amusement park go to a water park go anywhere you want to go and change your environment change your roots to work if you have to whatever you have to do is you need to change your routine you need to change your environment that's exactly how you change your life overnight i'm not playing this is no games once you do it you will see your life is going to change you're not stuck in the same routine. You're not stuck doing the same shit. You are thriving and you are excelling in so many different ways. And your peripheral and your view and what you believe, what you see, what you hear, what what you smell, everything will change as soon as you step out of your environment and move to somewhere else, move to a different location, thrive in a different location, learn in a different location, become who you want to be in a different location because this is not it. Where you are right now is not it. Or you would not be trying to change your life right now. You would not. Okay. The last thing I'm going to say seems very simple. Seems very easy. Because it is. But once again, we're limited by our mindsets. And our mindsets can stop us and deter us from moving forward. And that is my last tip is going to be to wake up and work out. This brings me back to the last tip of changing your environment. When you wake up, you normally scroll on your phone. When you come home from work, you normally scroll on your phone, whatever. Okay, but especially when you first wake up, you scroll on your phone, that is fucking you up because you're getting all of these distractions and all this dopamine and all of the all of this overstimulation. As soon as you open your phone and go on Twitter or you scroll on your phone and you scroll on Instagram, you're it's messing your whole routine up of becoming who you want to be. So I suggest waking up and working out or going to the gym because that alone will change your life. Instead of waking up and scrolling, how about you wake up, get dressed for the gym and go work out. Pay attention to your health and your wellness. Put that in the forefront and see what changes in your life. I'm sure so much will change for you. I'm sure so much will change for you. So I say all this to say that we only have one life to live, one life, and However you want to do it is up to you. It's not up to your your mom. It's not up to your sister, your cousins, your friends. It's not up to nobody but you. And only you can change your circumstances. Only you can change your life overnight. Whether you want to do it is up to you. Whether you want to change your mentality is up to you. Figure it out. Stop smoking weed. Stop drinking so much liquor. Stop scrolling on social media. Stop consuming so much content. Do something else. Change your life. And get the one up on people who are distracted. All social media and Netflix is doing is distracting you. You have to do things that fit into your new identity. And you have to do it right now. You have to do it right now in this moment. As soon as you get off this video, I expect you to go and do exactly what you were meant to do. Exactly what you were thinking about doing. I need you to go do it right now. Do the things that you need to do to get there as soon as possible.